Hello and welcome. Thank you for clicking on the video. Today we are, well this is Nate at uh, Nate's Manufactured Home Tours. Today we are at uh, Home Boys in Spokane, Washington. We're going to take a look at this home here. Nice, beautiful home. Do what I can to get you the best shot on the outside. Sorry, I'm right next to a busy highway here, so there's going to be a lot of traffic, so I'll try to make this brief. Hopefully you like what you see. So this home is going to be a three bedroom home, two bath, very spacious inside. I like the fact that they've got the uh, planks on it instead of the uh, vinyl siding here. Gives it that more high-end feel. Well, mind you, these are show models, so not everything is trimmed out completely. Not all the finish work is done. I'll take just a quick tour down the back side here, because they are fairly close together. I believe that's probably going to be your hot water access. Alright, let's go ahead and head on in and trust me, you're going to like what you see once we get inside. We kind of passed over this real quick. You do get some nice stonework. Nice little recessed porch. Step onto the porch as you're unlocking the door to get out of the rain, out of the snow, whatever. Alright, so first thing you got when you walk in is a little coat closet. A lot of coats can go in there. And we step into the living room. Give you a better shot of that uh, entranceway there. Now I'll come back over here to your living room. Very nicely staged. So I haven't seen the floor plans for these homes yet, but. Uh, once I get the floor plans, I'll go ahead and put the dimensions up for the uh, living room area here. Nice windows, big windows, lots of natural light coming in. Try not to show too much of the kitchen right away here. So then we'll come over here, it's gonna be your dining room area. Once again, great big windows letting in a ton of light. Probably didn't even need to have the lights on when I stepped in here. That's a eight man table, just to give you an idea of how big this living room really is, or dining room, I should say. I bet you that table is about five and a half foot long. Now your kitchen. Look at the size of that island. Seating for three easily. You could probably add a fourth person if you needed to. Looks like they've got uh, white cabinets underneath the island and the dark cabinets on the outside. Stainless steel Frigidaire appliances. Really nice countertops on here. Nice glass backsplash. Look at the size of that window over your sink. Holy. 
I didn't even notice that window was that big when I was walking through the backside. Get a fifth burner with your oven or your stove there. Your shells are adjustable. Drawers pull way out past the very end of the drawer there, so you can easily access anything in your drawers. Side by side refrigerator, freezer, nice to have. I believe, if I remember correctly, when I did a quick walkthrough, there's even a space for a full stand up freezer. Don't mind the trim supplies in here. Once you get your home set up, those will disappear. Big pantry. A better view with the light on there. Let's head on down here. So this is going to be your guest bathroom. It's a big bathroom for your guest bathroom. You got the nice square porcelain sinks here. Same backsplash on your countertop there and your big old mirror. This bathroom is pretty spacious for, for your kid's bathroom. You got the one piece shower tub combo there, nice transom window above. And if the toilet's there, that's definitely not a water closet. So what do we have back here? I would say that is a good sized linen closet. There's even a light in here. There we go. That's got to be one of the biggest linen closets I've ever seen in the bathroom. That's nice to see. So if you're liking what you're seeing so far, make sure you uh, go down there, leave a comment, let me know what you like. Hit that like button. We'll come over here, hit the uh, laundry room. There's your back door we had kind of breezed by real quick. There's that space for your stand-up freezer I was talking about. And I always like when I see this in the homes. It gives you a nice place to put your shoes, your coat, kind of just drop everything off when you will come in from the from outside. Lots more storage space. Looks like you got a great big folding table over here. It's gonna be your washer and your dryer set up. Nice sink in the middle. I know sometimes you gotta pre-rinse things before you put it in the wash to get all that extra dirt off from working outside. Now let's go out and over here into the bedroom. So you got nice sized bedrooms here. Big tall window. That window goes from almost from the floor to the ceiling. These do have nine foot ceilings in them. Makes the home feel really big. Nice size closet here, much better than what I've seen in some homes. Once again, you got that great big window in your second bedroom. I believe these bedrooms are going to be just about the same size. Once again, I'll put up a Dimensions of the bedrooms once I get the floor plans. Nice big closet again. 
All right, let's go take a look at that master bedroom and uh, master bathroom. I'm sure you're really going to like what you see. We always got to save the best for last. So again, take a look at your kitchen as we come down. Two really big windows beside your bed there. That is a queen size bed. I think it could probably fit a king size there. Not sure if you're picking up any road noise or not, but it is really quiet in comparison to what it was outside. Can't hardly hear anything. So these homes are very well insulated. Really big master bedroom. When we come over here, we've got a really nice closet. If you needed extra racks, I'm sure you could probably have a whole nother rack put in. There's a wraparound closet. Nice to see that there are no wire racks in this home. You can see this closet is really big. And coming back over here, it's going to be your master bathroom. Separated sinks with a center console, so to say. I know that's an automotive term, center console, but you got a center stack there. A wave to the kid. Hello, Raiden. So those of you that are new here, I have a six-year-old kid. You got a kick out of watching me, or he was watching me edit a video one time. Oops, here we go. So those of you that are new here, I have a six-year-old kid who was watching me edit the videos saw me in the mirror he tried to wave of course I couldn't wave back so now he gets a kick out of it when I wave to him simple water closet there is no tub in this bathroom but you have a really nice big shower in here nice big tile shower Dual windows up above. A little extra support on the wall there for your glass there. All right, so if you like what you see, go down below, leave, hit that like button, leave a comment, let me know what you like, what you don't like does help the videos perform better don't forget to hit that subscribe button hit that notification bell right now I upload videos twice a week every Sunday and Wednesday once again this is Nate with Nate's manufactured home tours here at home boys in Spokane Washington and we will see you in the next one thanks a lot bye